Hi guys, Shomaker here playing XCOM 2 and uh, today we will be moving on. Um, we have options now, something I haven't had in the past while. I have most of my troops good to go, ready to rock and roll, and uh, I want to bring my biggest, baddest guys down to South Africa where we have a um, codex uh, related mission. Gotta be careful when we travel to. So I got, I got three days to make contact with South Africa. So I've got my supplies, I've got my extra troops. I don't have any extra engineers and I probably won't get any. It'd be nice to get them though. At some point I'm gonna have to stop and get an extra engineer. It's just gonna have to happen. Hey, nice. Uh, this power coil room actually gives me power. built a powerful room draw no power so hey that's a good thing it's always a good thing uh, so we're gonna relocate did it yeah so that vastly increases our speed here on construction of this it's now gonna take only seven days um, I haven't built any labs and I haven't built any uh, engineering base yet and I probably won't because um, I'm pretty deep into this game and I've just been ahead on a lot of things. Yay! Another exo suit. Yay! Yay! Powered armor is gonna take another seven days. So boo. Oh, maybe I won't be doing what I thought I was gonna be doing. Uh, so this is for 108 intel. I kind of want an engineer here. That's a ranger. That's 198 supplies. Okay, so I don't really need any of these things. So what's the easiest to accomplish? They're all too difficult and uh, very difficult. Uh, so that's further away from me. This is closer. I'll do the intel. So you have codex, elite officers, elite shield breakers, elite troopers, archons. I could... I could hypothetically ignore them, but I don't really know what the... Uh, the downside is here. Like, maybe something bad will happen. Uh, so it is difficult, so I gotta bring some top-rung guys. Um, who do I have here? Two rangers and a sharpshooter. Well, I'm gonna leave chops behind. Because chops might be too good for this. Um, I don't have any rooks. So I'll bring this other ranger from Russia. And... Got to make all that armor available, and all the items available. I'm going to give this Rook the suit. Actually, I have two suits now, so i got to give out two suits, I guess. So one will go to him. That'll be fine. And Plasma Grenade, probably fine as well. Good job, Zukurvop. And the other one will go to our... Specialist, I suppose. And we'll give the specialist a flashbang. Gives you a little bit of disorientation on the enemies. Saves you, perhaps. Uh, so we're gonna sit the mine jack. It is an insta kill, which is nice, but I need other items. Um, I need to get another mimic beacon in here somewhere. Wait, my specialist actually should have the nano med kits. And then this ranger can flashbang. So two balls, two concussives. Two grenades, um, a healer, and we have two rockets. This is looking like a pretty good squad. Sky Ranger deployed. Menace ready to deploy. Operation First Cry. 
like a baby. Here we go. A terminal connected to the Advent network through one of their facilities in this area was left exposed by a resistance hacker during a previous intrusion attempt. We think it may be possible to recover data critical to the aliens' latest operation and stop their progress, but we'll have to move fast. Advent is already working to close the connection. Remove enemy forces from the area, lock it down, and recover that data. Well, this is a mission I've done a million times before. I feel like I need to get uh, some kind of oil or something because this chair squeaks like a mother. I've had this chair only three years and it's got a lot of scuffs and cuts and breaks and wires popping out and um, I'm always pretty hard on things I sit on. I'm not going to lie about that but this is ridiculous like stuffing's coming out. And is that a line of crumbs? Oh, it is a line of crumbs. I'm putting that back in there. That's disgusting. Ugh. Little bitty, itty bitty incidental sized crumbs. Jesus. What? I do play a key keyboard. So I got that one from the Okay, it's rock and roll. Oh, I start off on the roof. That is such a huge bonus. This is Avenger. The access point we're after is just ahead. Move to secure the area. Expect hostile resistance. Okay, so I have to just neutralize all enemy targets, and I have eight turns to get to the network shut down. What do we have here? Something this different. Thing looks ready to smash something. Is that an environment suit? Maybe something that can't handle our atmosphere? Those emissions could be toxic. I advise caution, Commander. Affirmative. Moving out. Combat. So here's the combat drones. That's affirmative. Nice, you can actually fire on something on a codex. So every codex that gets hit will split off into a second codex, which will in, uh, in turn cause the other codex to lose health. Um, so let's present squad site and return fire and quick draw. I'm going to save quick draw, I think, because I want to open this very specifically. So we'll use the Overwatch pistol for now. Affirmative. Covering now. Um, this person has burned through. Oh, that's right. This person's an Overwatch. I think. Hopefully. Maybe not. So how I'm gonna open this is I'm gonna open this with a rocket shot on three of these guys. This one's for you. This will cause the codex to split. We're busted. There's one split. <laughs> not bad, not bad. Armor still holding. Okay, so this is why really wanted to get this guy up here. Uh, so I can use a protocol and then I can use something else another turn. So a protocol. I will a protocol on our sniper top shelf here. And this is only going to offer defense. And this shouldn't, hypothetically should not burn full turn. Oh cool I got threat assessment. Oh, that used the whole turn. That is angering. Of 
course, it would only give her the pistol shot instead of the, sh the sniper. Went off the armor. They've seen me. Oh, this person wasn't even revealed yet. That's unusual. <laughs> Jesus, that was a miss. Well, this opens up my cover position. Now, what kind of ability are we going to have here? Uh, ammo neutralizer, perhaps? That's exactly what it is. And it hits everybody. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. So they're going to get a full turn of good shots on me. And smartly choosing to use the overwatches. Double overwatches. Okay. Um, so I kind of need a turn to recover from all this. So I'm going to need to burn a, um, a grenade here. You know, I'm gonna have this guy be the guy. He does this, I just gotta find him a decent spot. No problem, boss. So he's gonna take some hits, the overwatches. Because he has high ground and he's pretty armored. And I didn't take both hits, unfortunately. Okay. Maybe friend Anton can do this. So this should be a reaction job. That one's a... No, it's been a miss. That one's a hit. But Anton gets a kill. Enemy eliminated. Now positions won't matter too much. Won't matter a little bit, but not too much. Because I intend I don't want to run too far, just here. But I still got him, somehow. Makes no sense at all, in fact. Uh, so now the, the end of the master plan is me moving this guy here. And then going for a mimic beacon. And this person, I'm going to place where? This is a full cover here, but will this pull more people? Oh, that beacon didn't burn this guy's whole turn. I could probably kill that guy with a combat protocol then. And then only one of them I have to deal with, and perhaps that will all have been a waste of a good beacon. This is a 100% hit for damage. That's no if ands or buts. Friendly fire damage. See, this is probably a bit of a waste, but, um... Holy explosive damage, that man. I gotta get the rest of my squad up, so I'm gonna fire on him with this person here. He's already pretty far forward, and, uh, he's just oozing. Oh, he's back to the We all saw that thing go down. Now what the hell is it doing? Okay. Um this could get bad. Oh, it's mechanical. Grab that 
spot. Okay. It turns into a mechanical after it dies. So I can take temporary control here. Oh no. No, 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 no. No, no, I'm not accepting that. That's not acceptable. I have a 95 skill on that person. Uh, it says I have a 40% chance of getting it done, but with that kind of skill, it... No, I'm taking that control of that guy. There's no way around it, but I will change my strategy up a little bit. Um... I'm going to use my forward scout in uh, concealment because this person has the ability to reconceal, and uh, I'm going to use other people to kill this thing off. Uh, probably our well, it's not a rook anymore; it's our other ranger. But I will keep my distance, and then once I have this thing taken over, I can use it to rush it into enemies, and I don't know. It's got a lot of movement steps, so from its current position, I assume I can do a nice bit with it. Or I can just... Well, I'll reload anyway. We're green to go! Actually, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a shot, because I'll save combat protocol for something else. Wait. He reloaded? Oh, I wanted him down here to do this. Now it's starting to make more sense. I was like, why does my ranger have combat We're ready protocol? To go. There we go. Good riddance. I guess I'm gonna skip this. Oh, I can't skip it. We all saw that thing go down. Now what the hell is it doing? Oh wait, this is... Why is it... Why can't this person conceal? Unit is flanked. Oh, interesting. Okay, so I have to take this over first. Making new friends. I always like to try this with loads and saves and whatnot. Um, basically the odds of it. So this is a 37% chance. It's about one third. I'll try this three times. Actually, it's a more higher chance than that. 39% chance. Two and five chance. Jesus. Okay, so I'll try it one more time, and then I'll go for the uh, stun on it. Because, uh, yeah, I, I I could be here all day doing this. I could, but uh, it would be ultimately pointless. You can do this other. You can win this other ways. It's just nicer to have control of this thing. And I'd also like to be able to see what abilities it has and learn more about that specific class. That's another bonus for me because this is legitimately the first time I've seen this thing. Um, I played an entire playthrough already and I have not had not seen that guy. Good to go. Nailed him. We all saw that thing go down. Now what the hell is it doing? Okay, is this the last try of this? Hey, why I pushed cards ago. This would give me basically I've tried six of the five times. I see how this is gonna go. I see how this is gonna go. So we'll just uh, we'll just pack him and stun him and actually kill him. He'll be stunned for a few turns. We can get some good shots in on him, all that good jazz, and uh, I'll work on getting my other ranger concealed, scout ahead a bit, perhaps even crack the code on uh, our main objective. And while this guy's stunned, I'll be moving everybody forward. 
and uh, just, you know, keep going on, going on. It was just a sectoid inside. Now what the hell is it doing? Okay, so we'll haywire it. After a reload. Let's rock! Making new friends! Andromedon shell. They call it Andromedons. So, temporarily disabled. Are you kidding me? Really? Really? Dude. 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 I was barely willing to accept you not hacking appropriately. I am definitely not all that accepting of you uh, screwing me like that. Are so hard. 77% chance I only get to the 11% marker? Not happening. Not even close. I will only do a select number of times to go for that, uh, go for a, a hack, you know, but. Okay, you know what? I'm going to change up my strategy a little bit. So, this person will be the psycho killer. Okay. <laughs> also a 10 shot. Kind of impressive. I was. Thinking I'd save my guys closer. Okay. Reload. Haywire. Back in. Making new friends. I've double rethought what I'm going to do. Double, double rethought. I'm still going to hack him, don't worry. I'm going to get angry at the uh, ridiculous chances of failure here. The the percentages in this game are a complete and utter lie. I can do this a million times. I would never hit 77%. Never. I, can, I think I can hit the 30% marker. I can think I can do that, which is a 70% chance to do. This is getting outrageous. I rethought my rethinking, and with that rethought of rethinking, I thought of a new way of re tooling. So I'm gonna take the sniper, reload the sniper, right? Use the lightning hands. Right? Still not, still not done, guys. Still not done. Still very scary. Now what the hell is it doing? Okay, so we're gonna get the haywire protocol on. Oh, I forgot the reload. Oops. Okay, seventy-seven percent chance for a stun. Do it up. Oh, now you get the control out of me. Jesus. Okay, at least stunned. Disabled him temporarily. Right, not a bad thing. We're good to go. Okay. So like I said. I had changed my thinking on thinking on. Now I get the extra shot here. Now he's not he's not high crit anymore, unfortunately. But this is still a high amount of damage on him. Okay. No, 
Now we have over here. That was a miss, unfortunately. It's still moving. Now I think I have like this is double shots, right? First shot doesn't count. Or do I not have that yet? And maybe I don't have that with her yet. So I probably don't have that with her yet. Okay. But anyway, um she is gonna get another shot here. And it's all that's green is golden. Okay, so he's basically dead. I mean Make sure I reload this time. Cost him a turn. Uh moving this hero up to not cover. Just because I'm pretty sure this thing's going to die here, and I shouldn't run into anybody. There we go. I was worried about, like, explosions Target and... Down. There's this ooze here, you know? And he said, stay away from him. Moving on target location. Okay, so I'm not actually going to move too far ahead with Coming these out. people. Uh, because I want to use conceal. I was never here. And get in here. Let's see what's actually Got inside. Because I say uh, it's what's inside that counts. And wow. Hello, game cheating really hard. I see. Guess I'll cheat back. Uh, they're supposed to show you the tiles where you can't step to preemptively. I guess it's beyond her vision, so there's that part of this. But yeah, a little bogus there. Uh, so my intention here is to use the scout to just look ahead, and I've seen what's there, and my scout can position to uh, get a flank on these guys, and then unload a really, really powerful crit shot. Definitely later in the game, these uh, scouts that do flanking maneuvers uh, get pretty big heads up on those that don't. So I'll head a little more over this way this time. Moving to designated coordinates. Nice again. Kill confirmed. No ooze this time. Already a change. So I know I don't need to overwatch, so I can take him a little bit further forward. Right here. Getting it done. See if running over the ooze hurts him. Nope. It's fine. This game really lacks a lot of uh, uh, ground effects no problem, boss. compared to the previous game where the uh, what do you call those guys? Thin men Hidden away. were kind of terrifying. So I can't run all the way over here. Why is that letting me run? There we go. On the move. Looks like hostiles over here. Might be where hostiles over here too. Judging by the or that's just the size of their window, perhaps. Okay. In position. Oh, deep cover? What's that mean? I guess it doesn't mean she actually uses her weapons. That's the problem. Orders confirmed. On the move. First move. There they are. Doesn't matter if they find her now, because uh, they've already revealed themselves. Does she have a good shot at anybody? Uh, turns out not, but she's in a revealed grid. Uh, Grid and reveal. So I'll put him all the way over here. It's a bit of a hop, skip, and a jump for him. Uh, 
Oh, she can fire on somebody. 35% chance at the commander. No, thank you. Um, geez. I guess I can put her all the way up. If she does have a grenade that can get used here. Ten four. Uh, what do we have here? Throw plasma grenade. This will get rid of a nice bit of cover. Nice. Wait, it got rid of my own cover. Oops. Oopsie. Um, I do have moves, though. Maybe I can flank the um, guy here and just get a flat kill on him. On your order. They've seen me. I've got eyes on an advent position. Oh, oh, that was a bad move. I'm taking that back. That was a terrible move on my part. I opened myself up to so much more hate than I wanted to. I have to pull her back, actually. Because that grenade blasted. I can't lose. That's the thing about this stage of the game. You can't lose your big guys. You can't lose your big guns. You lose your big guns, and you have no big guns available for doing the big missions. And this is not even a big mission. This is a training mission. I'm here training uh, my one of my rangers here. Who is performing well, actually. Which is good, actually. Okay, so that's gonna spot them. Yes! I can handle the three of them. It's the other three that'll be a bit much. And the other three should be the last in the mission. I think. I only have four turns to shut this network down? That's not a lot. Confirmed. So I'm gonna make a... a remote hack go of this. I think I should be able to rem remote hack this. So we're gonna get a shot on the two of these guys, plus... Um, a little bit of damage to surrounding areas. And... Wow, that actually killed that time. Only 35% chance, even with his cover blown up as it was. Um, so I'm going to keep her a little bit further back just to clear up our area. Now, this person... Jeez, if I run in there and ninja chop, uh, totally dead. There's a lot of fire around here. If I pull back, they might reveal up here. Can I, who, who else can I, can I ninja chop him? And will he be in range of the explosion? And what does the ninja chop guarantee me? Not even a kill. Okay, so I'm gonna pull back here where it's safer, but I'm revealed. And we'll go for a shot. 45% chance for a kill. Miss. Miss, 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 miss. I am getting Get used to missing so freaking much. Now they should move. I should have put this on overwatch, actually. Oh. What? Are you, you going to die here? Or did that thing already explode? Okay, so my scout is marked, which is fine, because I don't actually have another ability to use there. And this person's probably shield. Yeah. Okay. Menace one five. The advent network is almost entirely locked down. We're running out of time. Get to that terminal. I think my hacker can long range hack it though, can't they? Yeah. Oh, long range hack that. Let's see what this Infiltrating gives me. Access point. Actually, I know I'm running out of time and and I can do this later, but I just like to see for now what this gives me. Um, soldier immediately gains concealment. Squad immediately gains concealment. Sick. Okay, so I'll hack that after, actually, because um. 
that's actually really good for later on. I can get a jump on the last few enemies. Okay, so instead... Jeez, uh, how much does the rocket do? And does it hit both? So four to seven, and we'll hit both. So probably worthwhile. Okay, so I have two ninjas. 57% damage. How's my sniper look for damage? 62? That's much better. Um, face off is probably not that valuable here, actually. So let's go for the sniper shot. He's armored, so he'll soak a little bit of that. But not that much! Jesus! Well, that's what you want to call it. Um, so we're gonna go up and ninja chop this guy. Uh, he ya. Nice. Kill confirmed. And this person will also ninja chop. But we're standing next to fire, so I might catch on fire, which is probably gonna suck. I'm burning up I'm here. I'm burning up here. That was not a good pathing for that ninja chop. I thought she'd take a different one, actually. Target okay. eliminated. Okay. I'm on it. While she's on fire. Oh, that didn't feel good. No, it didn't. Now you're injured for a bajillion turns. Good job. Um, so, let's go for that hack, because now we know what that is, in progress. we know that it's probably a good thing. Full on a good thing, we know it's a good thing. Okay, so, Hail Mary. Try it again. I'll I'll get I'll give it one more try, and then I'll go for the individual concealment. This is angry me. This is what angry me sounds like. Some people would say not that bad. Okay, so the enemies are down, right? I mean, uh, yeah, okay. We're gonna go for that hack again. Infiltrating access point. Just so close. So close, okay. Um, well, having one squad mate concealed is not terrible either. That means I can get one person to maneuver around and get the jump on the enemy and all that sort of jazz. I am running out of turns though for actually hacking their systems. So I have to be ever so cautious about that. Okay. You know what? I want to do it one more time. I'm sorry. I want to try it one more time. I want to go for the whole squad concealment. It's just infiltrating access point. The odds of me getting this are 50-50. 48% is pretty damn close to 50-50. I mean, I've done pretty close to the odds, but now I'm going to overdo the odds. Okay. 50-50. Please. You are a little slot. You do not deserve this. Okay, let's go ahead and go for the single person hack before my game blows up from loading this too often.
which it's done in the past to me and made me very upset. Okay. So, individual concealment. Do Accessing it up. system. Okay. So we have individual concealment. So, the soldier immediately gains concealment. Not bad, friend. So... I can still use this, because that just basically transforms this person into a, uh, a scout who can be out in the open. Understood. Moving out. Now, this guy... No. This guy. He's gotta get out in there. They probably can see me through here. Heading out. But I'll be able to do this in one turn. Nope, they wait a minute. Why won't it let me hack this? I have to be on the other side. Really, game? Really? On the move. Okay. Objective located. Do you say so, game? Now, hacking while on fire is a Commander, <laughs> we have confirmation of the exposed access point. Extra level badass. Already there! Roger that. I want to use this uh, scout to kind of get in that building and uh, get a flanking position on the enemy, but for now, uh, they'll sit. I might need some help! I get it, you're burning. Yes. Big cry, baby. Menace one five. The Advent Network terminal is shutting down. This is your last chance to secure the data. Okay, so there should be a hundred percent hack. It's um, the extras that are what important. What extras can I get? Um. So income from current region increased by twenty five. Delayed the Dark Event project by, like, they're both pretty much Hail Mary, so I'll go for the alternate Hail Mary. Get an extra two days of delay there. What? We've got access. Okay. Um. We've confirmed successful acquisition of the Advent files. Eliminate any remaining hostiles in the area. So, I gotta get her to a position where she can siege over here, so that'll be right here. On your order. Unless there's somebody else in here as well, which would make the uh, intel a liar intel. It amazes that no one ever questioned how these factories work. Meat comes out, but you don't see any livestock going in, do you? That is true. Okay, so, our concealed squaddy. Roger that. See, you can now see the enemy here <coughs> to the red tiles, so. Or no, that's just that monitoring tower. That's not even the uh, enemy, is it? Okay, I need a. This is a whole cover here. Heading out! And just take it slow and steady because there is no rush. Here they come, and they've used up their they've used up their movement stats. So now they gotta run into position. Enemy on the move. <coughs> They're flanking us. And they're actually gonna go inside the factory. 
that could be brutal. And I just blew up my only cover. Jesus. Friggin' rooks. Okay, um... 87% chance to get a... more than a kill. A, an overkill, perhaps. Nope, it'll just be a kill. Seven damage. That is a kill, actually. Thank you, game. Uh, so in the name of all things, I don't actually have to spend a lot of time here. I'm going to throw Mimic Beacon. Just because there's actually no rush for me to <coughs> get out of here. I can take as many turns as I need. As long as people aren't taking more Who damage. Is the position? I mean, this Rook is uh, now stuck forever in uh, the hell that is... Getting. Not much of a hit. Not too far off life. Toss me some ammo. So this person's not revealed yet, so I can rush all the way across here, right? And not get revealed. In position. Now they do all their goofiness here. <laughs> all that for a miss. You, know, you lined it up like, like like a first playing t ball. You know, you gotta line up that perfect shot. You gotta go in for that perfect swing. Uh, time is right, you miss. Okay. Moving out. I'm just gonna do one move here. And I have uh, other tools available to me. So I will wait on those guys. Uh, apparently I have a shot from here. Really long range shot actually. As long as you have vision, snipers can shoot anywhere. And we killed him. So that's perfect. Wait. He not dead. He not dead. Um, well, they both have samurai swords. Now, what do I have available here? Scanning protocol, running gun. Is there a window back here? No, no window back there. Okay. <clears throat> Sister option, this door here. Move into designated position. Oh, how bizarre. <clears throat> I can't actually fire from here. For some reason, I thought I could, but I totally can't. Um. Aid protocol? Oh, did I aid protocol myself? Oh, that's a dumb move on my part. Really dumb. Okay, well now he's just gonna throw a grenade at me. Oh, nice. I can actually put this person, separate this person. Because <coughs> this is a, a higher ranked ranger, this is a lower ranked ranger. This guy can sit a little bit. That's fine. So the Overwatch should not go off there. And. He is, in fact, going to take some damage, but he does have the, that awesome armor on, which will save the day here. Yeah, I intend to put 8 protocol on, on this guy. Uh, but that did not happen. Uh, so let's give this guy a level. He's gonna be sitting for a bit, so he might as well be a little bit bumped up. Let's give him a level here. 
do a little bit of ninja magic. Oh, really? 78% chance? My ass. Shot wide. Okay. Well, we're going to have to finish this all up with this ninja, then. Ooh, Oshui Nama And an item. Terminated. Target sighted. Nice. Hair trigger, events hair trigger. It's accuracy or, or crit. Target asset located. Status confirmed. Oh, hostiles are down. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Mission accomplished, Commander. Um, three wounded, actually. Eleven killed. Excellent rating. It'd be nice to get a perfect for once. I mean, I have gotten the perfect before, but... I so desire what they have. Well, back to the base. So, shot chance was pretty good. Average damage, pretty good. Um, our highest damage dealer was, surprisingly, our Rook. And I was actually specifically trying to get him to do a lot of killing blows uh, whenever I could because I wanted him to get that level up. I wanted him to get some experience out of this because, you know, he's probably going to be sitting for a while and <coughs> it's good to balance it around. Uh, made most attacks, Rachel Wood. Um, that is our other assault. And uh, the only other important set is the fact that our, our support, due to the fact that he was able to double conceal, was able to move the furthest. Let's we'll see if anyone's gravely wounded. S small wounds I can deal with, that's not a big deal. And I actually have enough people sitting around that I can do the uh, South Africa mission pretty well. But uh, grave wounds look bad because you, with grave wounds you lose them for uh, pretty much a month and it almost forces you to hire replacements. So just waiting on the end of this. Wow, nobody got a level up. We have one gravely wounded, our Rook, uh, two wounded, and top shelf is still active. Two missions, four kills, that's a pretty good record. I mean, nothing like, you know, 13 missions, 31 kills, or 11 missions and 40 kills. Frig. But, uh, okay, nobody got level ups. That kind of sucks. So we got two Codex Brains, we got two pieces of loot. And Dromedon Wreck, which means you have something new to study. And a bunch of corpses sell off to the resistance or use for other things. The being that inhabits these suits clearly come from an environment utterly hostile to humans. The corrosive substance they use as a weapon may be equivalent to water for them, but on this planet it's deadly. I theorize as to how a substance could somehow be used to our advantage to fire our explosive weapon system. Another possible upgrade. Hello, Commander. Oh, what was that? I just double clicked it. It all went away. Um, so yeah, we just have to wait on powered armor to Research is proceeding as planned, Commander. His lips did not move. Just gotta finish on this uh, powered armor before I can start that. 
The aliens yeah. have considerable resources at their disposal, but we've still managed to do reasonably well against them, despite our own limitations. Anyway, that's it for me for today. I will see you guys again tomorrow for more XCOM 2. See you guys then.